is back. Hit it. Ha. Sand Hit it. and. Ha. Oh God. Ha. What's Hit up it. with you? Hip hop uncensored is the vibe, so subscribe. Hip hop uncensored is the vibe, so subscribe. Oh God, driving Sam and riding passenger side, and you heard it out the mouth of the greatest rapper alive. Interested in promoting your brand, business, or talent on Hip Hop News Uncensored? Hit me up right now at advertise at hiphopun.com. That's advertise at hiphopun.com. Hit me ASAP. Very affordable rates now to our regularly scheduled program. All right, man. New York MC Young M.A. has left her fans alarm with this disturbing message that she actually put up on her IG. And it pretty much, you know, said, um, you know, about to lose this addiction on my way to rehab. Now, she also wrote, you know, in a lengthy little uh, paragraph there. Loving God, I pray that you will comfort me in my suffering lend skills to the hands of my healers and bless the means used for my cure give me such confidence in your power of your grace even when i'm afraid i may put my whole trust in you now i'm not going to be the one that's going to you know um say exactly what it is because she's not saying what her exact addiction is but i will just you know they say the picture says a thousand words so i'll just you know guess that it's probably one things maybe even a number of things um a lot of times in hip-hop and not all the time you know you see people with these double cups a lot of the times you know they're drinking lean you know i mean uh, mix some type of alcohol or something like that and i think we have to be you know responsible adults and be realistic and knowing that yeah it's a lot of young children adults and all types of people that are addicted to many different things. It don't have to be lean. It may be Xanax. It may be Percocet. It may be something that you're getting over the counter. It may be something that you get off the street. This is the reality of America. Now, I haven't really looked through the comments, but I'm pretty sure you, you're going to have haters and stuff saying, yeah, this and that. And this is really, you know, in my opinion, my humblest of, of opinions, that this is a great time in her life because one, they always say the first thing you got to, you know, admit that you got a problem. All right. She admitted it. Now she's going to try to get herself clean. So for anybody out there that's spewing hate her way or anybody that's trying to the word they use now is called shame people for just having an addiction. I don't think it's the way to go. I think, you know, um, anybody who can overcome something like that, man, is somebody that needs to be praised. So shout out to young and May. You know, we have been very, very critical of her and some of her music and some of the things that she does but um she didn't have to say anything she could have just pretty much you know um you know just went in and did her thing and people would have never known so she's coming out telling people that she has an addiction now there's been many pictures and many people you know her with the double cup and we can't sit up here and get you know uh, speculate but you know uh, common sense tells you one thing and you know, when you're looking at things, especially like lean and different opioids and things like that, it ain't easy to come off of that type of stuff. You know, it's just not at the end of the day. So, you know, once again, shout out to her. Um, we, we come from a, you know, um, a community of, you know, people that, you know, came through the crack era, you know, the heroin era. Now it's the pill era. So you're going to have people out there that are addicted to these substances. It's like when was, people was coming up in the 70s and 80s and whatnot and you've seen people the crack was you know popping off and, and you had crack heads now you got pill heads now you got lean heads now you got meth heads you got you got it's just they add different drugs you know as we go along so you know uh i forget what like the statistic is but it gotta be like one out of five one out of six people you know have some type of addiction that they're dealing with maybe even higher than that but yeah, man, leave a comment below. What do you guys think about this young M.A. telling people that she's going in to rehab? Not specifying, because it's not really nobody's business, what she's going in for. You know, a drug, but saying she's going in and she wants to pray and support her for people. Y'all leave a comment below. Let me know what you guys think about this. Also, make sure you guys share the video and make sure that you guys smash that like button on the way out. It's your brother, Oga, with another hip-hop uncensored exclusive. With that being said, I'm going to digress. Hip-hop uncensored is the vibe, so subscribe. Peace.